I want to show a video here on making the return air quiet but on this one it's sheet metal so the sound is going up through the sheet metal and there's no room to line it so I'm gonna pull just a six foot section of duct I'm gonna pull it and put some 16 inch flex that will match the two and a half tons for the airflow and I want to show the sound difference so right now with me talking it's about 70 DB now let's watch what the actual sound is and I'm two foot back from the vent so it's about 57 dBA when it's set on slow so let me show you the ductwork downstairs and then what I'm gonna do so it's pretty tight but there's not much room to access the ductwork but basically the blower is on the bottom and then the sound is just echoing because it was never lined so it's echoing up through the sheet metal so we're gonna pull that piece out and replace it with some flex and then I'm gonna have two collars at the top and the bottom so the first thing to do is free up access and then I'm just gonna pull out this duct this drive slide right out same thing up there and give myself some space by removing the ductwork I could almost fit an 18 the bigger the better but let's look at that area so the old duct is 20 by 8 which is 160 square inches of cross-section area and then the round is 200 square inches that's pi r squared so I do have a larger duct going in and I'll be fine with the 16 rather than an 18 I see on the top I spread it out a couple screws and a couple screws there try to get it as round as possible and the corners just bang them in and then use silver tape to seal it up and then the structure is a bunch of screws that are holding it there next let's get the bottom ready get rid of these, all these lips and cut out our oval now to stop it from sagging you want to make sure that you tape tape the inside and then the outside gets nylon tied and make sure you got insulation around it so it doesn't let the insulation fall that insulation is important on the sound dampening because it's going to act like a blanket and no sound is going to reflect at all all right so I'm connected on the bottom connected on the top where it's not going to sag I put a little heat shield because clearance is one inch on B vent man we're okay here I just tied it off this stuff's non-flammable anyway let's go see how the sound looks and we picked up about 10 DB lower I hope you like watching the video. Thanks for watching.